What's up, YouTube? This is James Eric's dude. I am here in my backyard once again. Uh, so a friend of mine asked me to make a video for him uh, about removing the um, the roof gutter trim moldings, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so I had actually made one part of a video already, which I have somewhere saved in my phone where I'm out in the yard and I'm working on it. But then um, I thought to myself, uh, what would make the video a little bit better? Well, for one is to show you these guys. So that's, uh, what is that? 74306SH2010. And then uh, right here we have Seven four three one six SH two zero one zero. So I bought these bad boys um, on eBay um, for a uh, resto mod that I have, and I've already opened up one. So let me show you that. I try to keep it in that little, you know nice and orderly so when you get it out of the package it's literally just the trim um, so if you look at it closely here this is the forward part um, you can see the little guides in there and you notice that it doesn't come with any clips um, but it does have these tabs uh, here in the back and a tab here in the front. So, um, when you go on the roof, line, they go, they line up just like, like that. And so they all just pop in place and hopefully work out just right. I haven't compared, I um, have the US, US uh, version. I haven't really compared them, but they should work um, even though I got them from Japan. So, um, I'm gonna put this guy back in there so it doesn't get messed up or anything by accident. And we put him back in his face. So, um, when I was working on uh, CRX and Hatchback, they were both the same. Uh, what I did is start near the rear here and then just pry up with a uh, with a flathead screwdriver um, and what you're gonna do is pop the uh, the rear the rear clip and then what you want to do is make sure that you you go slow and steady and you keep uh, you don't bend the molding too much, otherwise it's gonna get kind of warped. And then if you were trying to replace this, if you're trying to use this one, um, if you're just trying to remove it and save this one for future use, uh, you obviously don't wanna bend it. So then, I'm gonna pop that front one and it's gonna be the same. It's like, There's just the, uh, there's no actual clips on this. And then looks like the one in the back, I kind of bet a little bit off. But that should, you should be able to reuse it. And as, let me show you the, uh, so this is how it's retained um, in there. This actually clips to the, uh, the trim. 
So that clips to the trim in the front, and then there's nothing in the middle. And then you have another clip uh, back here, which clips to the back side. <clears throat> so then obviously when you go to reinstall, let's see if I can get this back looking nice. I'm going to reinstall. There's um, some window trimming up here. Just going to see how far forward you want to go and then pop that into place. And it should, oh, there I go. That popped in. There's the clip. Some part didn't really clip in that well, but the uh, bad part, I heard a, a distinct snap. So that, this is kind of messed up there, but might be able to put a heat gun to it. And then a part of the trim is missing here. You can see this little guy, this little part is longer and it covers up. So that is uh, the removal and installation of the rain gutter trim. Uh, there's not really not much to it. Um, and like I said, the, the hatchback is the same. I think I might attach that video if I can find it to this video. Um, just to show you, um, but that's, that's about it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave a, um, comment. Um, any other input, uh, would be, or feedback is ap always appreciated. Um, yeah, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if this video helped you at all. And remember to, um, subscribe to the homies, Young Static, EF Buddies, John Martin, Brian, Lazy Man Garage. Um, Nate over at another year from blog, uh, Seth CRX, um, and then also uh, check out Leo's channel. Thanks for watching. Keep the S on the road. Peace. What's up, YouTube? This is Gene CRX, dude. I'm out here at the yard. It's uh, April 6, 2021. Um, messing around with this uh, 9091 Civic hatchback here. Um, I did grab a few uh, parts off of it. I grabbed uh, the uh, rear subframe, uh, fuel pump, and the turning switch for my, my the, for the homie uh, did here. Um, grabbed a few other miscellaneous parts as well, and the uh, front lower control arms. Um, it, as you can tell, it's, it's pretty stripped. Um, happy about that that you know the parts are being used uh, apparently this is the 90 <clears throat> but uh, so this video is going to be about removing the uh, the trim here the rain gutter trim uh, along the top so uh, what you're going to do is what I would rec or what I would recommend doing actually is starting from the back here and then tying up so you just be gentle if you want to try to reuse it otherwise um and then so when you run along here uh there's going to be two clip um two clip a clip back here and a clip up front and so they're built in uh it's kind of built into the car so you just going to pry up just being ever so gentle Remember, if you want to try to save it, uh, you don't want to bend the, bend the trim. And just kind of go to the side. So, you can see... There's a, a clip right here that's built in to uh, the car. And so that's like the retaining clip. So uh, just keep on going. And then if your trim 
it does get bent a little, try to bend it back into place. And just gonna keep on going towards the front here. And then once you get to the front, you'll run into the next. Next clip, just pop it up. And you can pop the trim right out of place like that. And then up here, you'll see the, the front uh, retaining clip. And then let me go back to so here you have little uh, bump stops. And so yeah, that's that's mainly the gist of it. Uh, when these come brand new, uh, they come just like this, and then you just gotta pop them into place. Uh, at least for CRXs, that's the way it is. Um, so I hope this video is helpful to somebody. Um, if it helps one person, my job's done. Um, subscribe to the homies, EF Static, uh, John Martin Bryant, John Martin Bryant. Uh, Lazy Man Garage, Garage Build Hondas, EF Buddies, and uh, Save the EFs. Uh, thanks for watching, and remember, as always, keep the EFs on the road.